adding a news article is quite easy. Once you've logged in and you're in the admin area of the website, simply go to posts and click on add new. This will take you to this screen. Works very similar to any type, any kind of word processor. If you're familiar with Microsoft Word or something similar, then these controls here that you see are quite similar. So first of all, we'll give our post a title. So this is a sample post. Now you may be speaking about a uh, marathon that's in the town. So you'd put, you know, 5K marathon, September the 22nd, for instance, that would be your title. So pick a relevant title that's, you know, uh, relevant to the news article that you want to publish. And then in this window here, you can literally just type away as you would do a normal word processor. Uh, again, all the controls are here. If you want to do a uh, heading or a subheading, you literally type the word and then select this drop down. Don't select heading one. It's just for, it wouldn't, it wouldn't break the website, but for search engine optimization purposes, the title of the post will always default to heading once and you should only really use that once on on each uh, news article so feel free to use any of the others heading two and three are perhaps the most popular so again if we click heading two we can see that that's now enlarged it it's a subheading and it will obviously apply the right code for search engine optimization purposes as well so again you could just continue typing anything you like you can um add images into here um, all you do is select where about you want the image to appear click on add media and either upload a file an image file that you've got or just choose an existing one so for instance we'll choose this one uh, and we can choose whether to have it on the left or on the right so we'll have this on the left you can choose the size and you can even choose to link the image to a different page or even a custom URL, uh, which is a different website. So if you were to do that, you literally put the website uh, bbc.co.uk or wherever it is that you want that image to link to. And click insert into post. Okay, you can see our image is there. We can, you can click on the image and literally drag it and resize it to any, any sort of size you like and you can see here on the right hand side are our categories so if you look at the front end of the website you can see that once we click on news here's our news news page you can see that here are different categories community culture lifestyle sports and so on and this is what these categories apply to so you could call it community if it's a, a, a news article about the community or again if you you know if there was a if there was a, a band playing in the local park, maybe next Thursday evening, you know, you probably culture and so on. Um, you can tick more than one of these if you like it to appear in both categories. You can do the tag section. Okay, you don't need to use tags, but let's say for argument's sake that you wanted to categorize even further. So, for instance, community. Let's say for argument's sake that there was a uh, ongoing planning proposal for new cinema, for argument's sake, in town. You could tag, if this was about the cinema, you could literally type cinema in there and add that as a search tag. Think of a tag as a way of just adding a label to different news items, okay? So if in another four weeks time you create another post about the cinema the title title could be um planning committee rejects latest proposal for cinema and again you could literally type cinema in there or you could go choose from the most used tags and you could look at what tags we've already got so for instance the cinema we'll click on cinema and we we'll add that and again anybody who was interested in following that story about the cinema they could easily select from the tags along the bottom of the posts uh, related posts about the cinema does that does that make sense okay so we've created our post we've added a, a picture um, we can also if we like set a featured image now let me just show you what a featured image does see this here that is a featured image for this story okay 
this story doesn't have a featured image. Does that make sense? So if we publish now without a featured image, our news article would look like this. If we had a featured image, it would look like this. So let's go ahead and we'll add a featured image. So we just click on set featured image and we'll just choose one that we've already got uploaded. So we'll just choose, uh, we'll choose this one. Actually, we'll choose that one because it's about running. Okay, set featured image and click publish. Just let this publish and then we can go to the front end and we can click refresh. We're already in the news section and there is our news article. You can see obviously we've just typed in nonsense, but there's our featured image that we've just added here. This is the image that we added into the post. And if people click on that, it expands the whole news article. People can leave comments and so on and so forth. Okay. Uh, and again, it will pick up what it thinks are related posts here. So once you start putting a few news articles on, once someone had read it, there will be related posts underneath that they can click through and read those as well. So that's how we add a news post.